Hmm? Have I read this before? I forgot. Yeah, I read that one, I think. bit Kamushida and all, but I'm still feeling kinda nervous. I guess we just gotta wait and see what happens. <sighs> My mom asked me to go grab stuff from the store today. What a pain. I should be free if something big comes up though, so just let me know. This sucks.
talking about? Does anyone actually believe that? Hilarious. Military buff. Oh man, you hear about the Makaranov coming out soon. When it comes to automatics, you can't go wrong with this. I can't wait to get my hands on a Makaranov man. Being patient is rough. <laughs> Alright, sounds good. Okay. All right, which one? Sounds good. All right, which one? Uh, come again. Takemi, in spring, one sleeps a sleep that knows no dawn, huh? Yawn, god, I need a nap, or at least some good old-fashioned caffeine in my system. So what are you here for today? I want to do a clinical trial. Takemi, I refined the medicine from the other day a bit. Could you come to the back? Please head to the exam room. I'm going to start setting up then. Head into the examination room. Hmm. Here you go. The effects should be instant this time. Let's see, eyes are focused. Look this way, one, two, three, four. Nothing yet. Hmm. The inside of my mouth feels like it's burning, and my nose is itchy. Oh. Oh, there it is. The inhibitory effect is just as I had hoped. Your weight was the primary reason. It took longer to kick in than expected. Yes, this is what I expected from a teenager. We're making great progress. Practice makes perfect, right? Okay, hold tight. Once I compile all the data, we can move on. Hello? Hello, Takemi Medical Clinic of Internal Medicine. How can I help you? An emergency, huh? But we are not a designated hospital. Besides, the head physician here is Tae Takemi. Huh? Awfully rude. Just hanging up on a lady like that. Was that an emergency? Oh. Oh, don't worry about it. An ambulance driver was looking for a transfer location. All the designated hospitals are full. But to think that accidentally call a general practitioner must have been a new paramedic. Hmm. 
He seemed to at least know my name though. I've been blacklisted by the larger medical community. They call me the plague due to a grave medical error I made. What do you mean? <sighs> this goes back to my old job. I used to work at the university hospital in the city. I was never actually convicted of anything, but I'm still considered a pariah in the medical industry. Does that scare you? Participating in clinical trials run by a doctor like that. Is it true? Takemi is silent. It's true that I put a patient in critical condition. Well, that's fine. Being ostracized has enabled me to focus on my own research and development. <laughs> Regardless, I look forward to working with you. I'll be sure to add some additional medicine for you, my little guinea pig. It feels like my bond with Takemi is growing even deeper. Rank 3 Confident Back Elite Doctor Arcana Death New Ability Sterilization Adds more healing items to the clinic All right. Hello? Dr. Takemi's Clinic of Internal Medicine Huh? Huh? One order of teriyaki chicken? You're all good for today. You can go home now. That must be a code. The one order of teriyaki chicken. That must be a code word. Takemi, come again soon if you are still alive. Take care. You too, Doctor. Takemi. Hey, my little guinea pig, I have to talk to you about something. You haven't told anyone about my drugs, right? Have you? Takemi, sigh. Of course I wouldn't talk about it. That wouldn't do me any good. Besides, I'm the one who suggested that rule when we agreed on our deal. Feels like I've been getting a lot more patients asking for drugs lately. Wonder where they keep hearing about me. It's been really bugging me. But that's all I wanted to ask, I guess. Okay, see you soon. Ah, you're back. A message from Ryuji. You heard anything about stuff happening to Kamushida? Nope. Ryuji, I see. Did something happen? Ryuji, I don't know. I'm just feeling kinda anxious. I keep thinking about how even with all you did, we might still end up getting expelled. My mom's totally gonna suffer if that happens. Plus, if we couldn't even help Anne or Suzui. Ren, we'll deal if we need to. Ryuji, guess I just gotta accept my fate. Now's not really the time to be getting pessimistic about this. Anyways, I'm feeling a little better now that I talked to you about this. Thanks, man. Oh, and don't tell Anne I was doubting us, okay? She won't have anyone to rely on if we are getting all worried about this shit. Well, see ya. 
Let's do it. Pompous customer. Ah, oh, I apologize if I've overstayed my welcome. I finished a critic for work, so I am partaking in a moment's rest. Oh, I already read this before, I think. Yep. Interviewer. Pawn to 5-6 on the first move was unexpected. This just might lead to a happy central rook. Ah, is there a special reason why it's called a happy central rook? Pro Shogi player. Well, the first Shogi player to use that move was the kind of person who was always smiling. That's really where the name comes from. It has nothing to do with the actual strategy itself. Interviewer. So the name doesn't clue you in on the strategy. It's really just named after a Shogi player. I like how Morgana stays on Ren's back. Really cute. Morgana, there are still some customers left. You should close the fridge door before you get in trouble. Oh, customers in Leblanc will go home after listening in on them a bit. Try doing this when you need to uh, do activities in the cafe. Well, I'll be going home then. Sojiro, hey, are you brewing coffee? I taught you how, so go ahead and give it a try. <laughs> well, if you want to help out with other work around the shop, I'm fine with that too, so how about it? Morgana, what are you going to do? Will you help the chief out? Help him out. All right then. Put your stuff down and grab an apron. Don't forget to wash your hands. Sojiro's guidance is extremely precise. I did just as he told me. Thanks. Hey, thanks for helping out. I got a chance to talk to this girl the other day. What? What? What girl? Dull student? Oh, like me, I'm dull. Dull student, I got a chance to talk to this girl the other day. We had an amazing conversation after I brought up some of the stuff I read about. We're gonna go out somewhere together soon. Well, don't get ahead of yourself because it happened to go well. Calm student. Look, knowledge isn't enough. You need proficiency to adapt on the fly. You also need kindness to be accepted and guts to be honest and direct. Plus charm to draw people to you. The quality of your character says a lot about you, so it's important to better yourself every day. Really? But it takes so much work. But I'll do it if it means I'll get a girlfriend. I guess I'll start by showering every day. I hear girls prefer a dude who's hygienic. Wait, you don't shower every day? What? Hey, this applies to you too. Why? Working hard helps build confidence. It's all about getting experience. Think you can get by on luck alone? Think again. Morning! Oh, hey, Ren. Morning. Hum, is there something over there? Come on, let's go. We're gonna be late. I just remembered. Miss Usami, 
There's been a lot of dire news lately, with the train accident and the volleyball team incident. People are theorizing that it's these sudden psychotic breakdowns, but the cause is still unknown. Well, unexplained occurrences like this are commonplace in the world of math. You. For instance, Amamiya-san, please look at this. It said you only need a few colors in order to paint so that adjacent colors are clearly separated. Do you know the name of the theorem? Name after this number. Ah, uh, alright, Morgana, hurry. Access my access uh, Ren's smartphone and give me the answer. Alright, thank you Morgana for color theorem. This is it. Correct. I suppose the four color theorem is common sense. As you can see, any flat image, a map of the world or anything can be painted using only four colors. Many people have realized this principle based on experience since ancient times. However, it's difficult to prove and was an unsolved problem for a long time. Black-haired student. Wow, really? Brown-haired student. Amamiya Kung seems kind of smart, doesn't he? Nice going. Wow, you must be really smart to be able to answer a question like that. Oh Morgana, stop being sarcastic. Miss Usami, I hope the psychotic breakdowns don't just end up as another unsolved mystery. My heart it hurts just thinking about the economic losses this string of incidents has caused. The world's full of dangers, huh? I guess even the world outside school is no good either. A message from Ryuji. You got plans today? I still can't just sit around and do nothing. I'm still in the hallway, so let me know if something comes up. Ryuji, oh, I'm gonna be doing some trading today, you wanna come with? I'd probably just slack off by myself, I mean it's better working with a partner, yeah. Hang out with Ryuji. Wanna get going? Awesome man, get changed and meet me behind the gym. Morgana, well I'm, I'm gonna walk around, let me know when you're ready to leave. Ah, uh, damn it. I want to move better, but I just can't. I was training for nationals back in the day, but now I totally suck balls. Irritated voice. What the hell do you think you're doing? Whoa! Nakaoka Takeishi. Nakaoka. Running, huh? I saw you from the window. Takeishi. What? 
You're gonna try to come crawling back to the track team? Ryuji. Huh? H hell no. Nakauka. Hmm. Speaking of which, this was your secret training spot, wasn't it? Nakauka. Well, it's our spot now. You know us, the former track team. Takeishi. We don't even have a locker room anymore, thanks to someone I know. Ryuji is silent. Ren. Want to train with us? Nah, this is not, not right towards Ryuji. Let's not fight. Ryuji, we ain't fighting. Nakaoka. Yeah, this isn't anything like a fight, not even close. Hold on, aren't you that transfer student? You really gonna hang around with this loser? Extract team member. You better watch out, he'll hit you the second he gets pissed off. I heard his dad was the same way. Like father like son, right? Now that's some scary shit. <coughs> Ryuji, that don't got anything to do with this. Calm down, Ryuji. Just endure it. I'll shut them up. I don't know. Does Ren, you know, can can Ren fight? Or he's a, uh, or, or or he can't. Can Ren fight? I'll shut them up. Ryuji. What? Hey, quit it. Nakauka. Humph. Guess you two are pretty similar after all. <sighs> Ryuji. Look, back then I... Nakauka. I don't need to hear your excuses. Everyone was going through the same bullshit with Kamoshida. The beatings, the impossible exercises. But we put up with all of it for the track team. But no, you had to go and fuck all of that up. Man, I was stupid for ever thinking you were my teammate. That's all I have to say to you. I'm out of here. <sighs> Ryuji. I nearly smacked him when he was talking about my dad. I haven't changed at all. But you know, you actually helped me calm down a little. I'm glad you were here with me. Thanks, man. Confident Ryuji Sakamoto Arcana Chariot Rank 3 New Ability Follow Up Chance to perform a follow up attack if Joker's attack does not down the enemy. Ah. Alright. Ryuji, let's call it a day. Familiar voice. Hey, Nakaoka, why didn't you kick his ass? What? The hell is your problem? Hmm? Ryuji, now they're just arguing with each other. I should stay out of it. See ya! Anyways, nice training with you. Ryuji, yo, it's me. You good to talk? I wanted to thank you again for today. I really owe you one, man. I get pissed off so damn easily. I really gotta work on that. Let's be empathetic. I can't exactly blame you. Ryuji. Nah, this one's definitely my bad. Besides, I can't cause a scene. Don't want to get you pulled into even more bad shit. Huh, I gotta wonder what they were arguing about. But hey, I'm an outsider. Nothing to do with me. Thanks again for today. Don't forget to massage your legs before you sleep, okay? See you later. Hmm, but why don't you massage my thighs? 
Ryuji. <laughs> I don't mind if you use the coffee maker. Just clean up when you're done. Really? A reporter. Today we talk about Inokashira Park in Kichijoji on this edition of Discovery, Town Detectives. Are you seeing these cherry blossoms? This place is currently very popular among families and couples alike. You'll also find a oh, pandit. You'll also find people going on runs or sketching. It's a great place to relax. Let's do it. So this is where the chief brews his famous coffee. Hey. Yo. You brewing coffee? Let me check the taste. Try brewing one now. We'll talk after that. He's testing on you on your co cafe training. Are you confident in your skills? Looks like you got everything you need to make some coffee. Let's see what we can brew. Hey! Are you going to make some coffee? I'll brew some coffee. Mm -hmm. You know how to brew coffee? Help yourself to the beans on the shelves. I'll show you how each kind of bean is different later. All right, I'm heading out to buy some cigarettes. Oh. Um, I love the smell of good coffee. Is that V20? Yes. All right. Morgana, the way you're drinking it makes it look delicious. This coffee has a lot of thought and love behind it, huh? Maybe if you drink it in the metaverse, it'll heal your wounds too. Leblanc coffee. Morgana. Haha, <laughs> looks like the chief's gentlemanly charm is rubbing off on you. Charm debonair, knowledge erudite, guts lion-hearted, proficiency transcendent, kindness angelic. <laughs> Looks like you're doing well. Here, let me have a sip. Mm. This aroma and soft richness. You use Blue Mountain, huh? Let me explain. Jamaican Blue Mountain. The Blue Mountains of Jamaica have a unique climate and volcanic soil advantages for growing their famous high quality coffee. The coffee undergoes a rigorous inspection process and is harvested in small quantities. This produces a rich coffee with a full aroma. <sighs> the flavor profile is bland. You should practice more to bring out that roast's full potential. Although I see you're preparing the cup the way I taught you, I'll acknowledge your hard work. <laughs> You look like a real barista standing at the counter like that. It seems like you're following all the rules and instructions I gave you. I can't believe this kid in front of me is a troublemaker with a criminal record. Maybe you should start be skeptical ab about Ren's criminal record. Sojiro is silent. Well, there's no need to have a lengthy conversation about this. Just keep up with your training. Morgana, you have the opportunity to learn, so you should take some time for yourself and keep improving. Nice. People would treat you with respect if they knew you could serve great coffee. Well then. We should rest now, we have a big day tomorrow.
<sighs> what up? He had a change of heart for real, didn't he? It's kinda hard to believe right now. I'm gonna cry if we still get expelled after all this. Me too. Right? Right, I knew it. I would have been super disappointed if you told me to calm down and wait or something. Oh yeah, you're free today. If you got nothing to do, come see me after school. It's not like I got something to say, but I find talking helps calm the nerves. Morgana, but just waiting seems kind of boring. How about we hit the batting cage? There is one right by the supermarket in Yongen, right? A message from Ryuji. I kinda wanna talk today. Well, more like I gotta unload all this crap off my chest. Why don't we go grab some ramen? You know, shake things up. I'll take you over to a special shop I know. Ryuji, dude, I really wanna talk, or I guess more like a vent. You wanna grab some ramen? I'll show you my go-to place. Hang out with Ryuji. Ryuji, it's kind of far, but it's totally worth. The flavors out of this world. Wanna get going? Anyways, it's in Ogikubo, so let's take the train over there. Wow, that's far away. How many stations? City Ogikubo, a quiet and convenient residential district famous for its ramen. Lip smacking good ramen. The deep flavor of old style soy broth is worth the long wait in line. All right. You now have information on a new hangout spot, Ogikubo Ramen. You can also invite people who may enjoy eating ramen to hang out with you there. <laughs> ah, I love the feeling of noodles sliding down my throat. Wow, that sounds sensual. Sweat dripping over my face. This shit's the best, man. Ramen is life. Like, light soup like this really gets your body going again after a good run, you know? We used to come all the way out here after practice and... Ah, uh, I guess that's all in the past. <sighs> By the way, I've seen Nakaoka around a few times. But for some reason, it, it don't look like he's getting along with the others. Getting along. Are you worried about him? Ryuji, yeah, kinda. I've been thinking about what he said. How the whole track team was putting up with Kamushida's shit. And how I effed it all up for him. I think he was right. They don't even got a club room anymore, so they've been storing all their stuff behind the gym. 
they can't use any school gear either so they just run laps around the block for practice there ain't really a place for outcasts like that i should know that better than anyone it's good they're keeping their heads low now though i don't want them ending up like me But you're doing great, well, Ryuji might disagree. It's not so bad, Ryuji might disagree too. I know how you feel. Ryuji, oh yeah, we're both outcasts here, huh? It's probably tough just walking around school for you with all them rumors and shit. Yeah, we really don't belong anywhere, but you know, maybe this ain't so bad after all. I guess now that I'm thinking about it, trying to fit in is a real pain in the ass. I mean, I'd never have met you guys if I wasn't an outcast, right? So, ah, uh, it's all good. <laughs> For real though, it's been a shit ton of fun hanging out with you guys, it's so freaking cool. Confident Riji Sakamoto Arcana Chariot Rank 4 New Ability Stealth Dash Makes you less likely to be found in the metaverse while dashing All right. hmm. Hey, that old guy with the white hair He doesn't eat anything Why? Ryuji I just hope that there is something I can do to help those track guys Though it'd probably mess them up if I try to butt in. Oh yeah, we still gotta find a new spot for our training. Hmm, I'll think about it. No slacking off till then, okay? See ya. Later, dude. Ah, you're back. Newscaster, the long weekend starts tomorrow and it, and it looks to be sunny. However, users of public transport have expressed unease in regard to the frequent accidents of late. Oh. Golden week, eh? I want to go out somewhere with Lady Anne. Where? The strip club? Or love hotel? Oh. Let's do it. you finally interested in coffee brewing, if you'll help, I can teach you. Help him out. Yeah. Then you can clean up. I'm going to finish preparing the curry. All right then. That's it for tomorrow's curry. Hey, how's it going? You getting any better at remembering how to handle different bean types? Now then, there are the three factors that determine the flavor for a cup of coffee, grind, heat and time. First up is the grind, for the siphons we have here, we are aiming for medium fine. Are you listening to me? What grind are you supposed to use? Uh, medium fine. Right, keep up the good work. It doesn't net much profit given the effort it takes, but hey, money is money. I'm not gonna forgive you if you serve our customers crap coffee though. Just remember that. Hmm? Who could this be? Yes, hello. How'd you get this number? Now, where? Fine. Sorry. Something just came up. We can keep going with the lesson some other time. Is it a date? Sojiro, if only. 
Just do the dishes while I'm gone. Oh, and remember to shut off the gas before you close up shop. It's nice having someone around to help at times like this. Turns out you're actually a harder worker than I thought. Keep it up. Confidant Sojiro Sakura, Arcana Hero, Rank 3. All right. The rest is on you. Okay, I'm off. Don't eat all our food while I'm gone. Sojiro, hey, you get everything closed up? Sorry about earlier, had to take care of some business. But don't worry, I'll put you to work. We've got lots of time on our hands. Ren, go easy on me. Sojiro, long as you help out and do your part, I'll treat you fairly. Just keep that in mind when you're working here. Well, just make sure you turn off the stuff before you head to bed. No surprise, waiting is pretty boring. I wonder what Ryuji and the rest are up to. Why is this? Why is it? Um, why, why is there no school on Friday? What day is this? Treasure room deadline? Oh, Showa day. Showa day. Oh, so it's a national um, off day. A message from Takemi. Have you had any side effects since then? Passed out at all? I'd like to check you out, just in case. I don't have any patients. Could you stop by the clinic? Morgana. Oh, hold on. Hey! We did all we could. Now we just wait and see how this turns out. These huge shelves are nice and all. It'd be nicer though if we had something to put on them. House plant. We thought it looked nice in here, but it looks a bit dead. Oh yeah. Come to think of it, you bought some plant nutrients, right? Why don't you try using them? Hold on. I should write something. Garden energy, a cheap plant nutrient. Bionutrients, a pricey plant nutrient for those who want good care for their plants. Alright, use bionutrients. Oh. These are some reasonably priced nutrients. This ought to bring a bit of life back to this plant. That should do it for a while. Nice. It looks pretty healthy for now. No, no. Okay. All we can do now is wait and see what happens. There's no point in getting impatient now. Okay. Host, hey there, next up is our special feature on the boy who's said to be the next detective prince. Host, 
The original Detective Prince was now Toshiro Gane, but people aren't excited about this new one. Panelist, my daughter is a big fan of the new Detective Prince. He's a sleuth in high school and so handsome. Leblanc still open, you should close the fridge before you get in trouble. Alright. Hey, hey. Hmm? Elderly male customer. I hear it's golden week, though I guess it doesn't matter to us old folks. Elderly female customer. Oh, it'll be so busy and crowded everywhere. I hope another accident doesn't happen. Elderly male customer. Yeah, no one's been able to figure out the cause behind that. That kind of makes me feel uneasy. Hey, thanks. I'll just leave what I owe you. What? Elderly male customer. Hey, thanks. I'll just leave what I owe you here. Okay. Hey. You're living an honest life? If you can't turn over a new leaf here, life won't be easy, you know? Mm -hmm. Go study or read a book if you have time to kill. Time is money, don't waste it. Hey. All sorts of people gather in the big city. Crooks are everywhere. Hey. Are you looking after the cat? Don't look at me for help. Mm -hmm. I'm not giving you any allowance. If you want money, get a job. This area reeks of alcohol. Old man, hum, did you want to listen in? DJ, today's topic is things you can do over your long weekend. I'm having a fancy lunch at a pricey hotel buffet with my boyfriend. Wow, I'm so jealous. Old man, humph, I don't see what the big deal is. Food's all the same anyway. Said old man. Sigh. I guess we can either go for a walk. Oh, I think I read this one already.
What? Fuck. Street Orator, I'm scheduled to give a speech here tonight. If you're interested, I'd love for you to come. I want young people like yourself to hear it. I think I read this one already. Lottery attendant, you have lottery ticket, yes? Allow me to check the result. Your result in this drawing is... Congratulations! You've won 100,000 Aang. Let me get that to you right now. Wow! Whoa! You're really lucky. This means my dinner tomorrow will be incredible. Welcome! Thank you for your purchase. The result will be announced in a week on 5-6. Please look forward to it. Testing man, you are all well aware, yes, the recent subway incident is still fresh on your minds. Yet, the investigation into the cause bears no progress. This is evidence of the power behind them. Men with clear eyes, don't bow down to the oppressive authority that deceives you all. Break free from its subjugation. 
protesting man. Yes, yes, I, the Sun God, will protect you all, blessing you with peace and security. What? Middle-aged lady, prices for goods are rising, tax rates are high, politicians are all talk, do they actually help? Middle My husband's pay isn't going up either, must be nice for you, your boyfriend's making bank. Young looking woman, it's not just the money, I mean he's really tall and good looking too. Middle-aged lady, what a catch, how did you find such a good guy? Young looking woman, er, uh, well, nothing special, it looks like we were just brought together by chance. The schools close, but the gates open. Some students might be here for clubs. So I can't get inside? This station is near a famous ramen shop. I should go eat with someone there sometime. Shibuya, a young person's haven. This major train hub houses a variety of stores. Wait, Ryuji? is here
Aoyama Ichome. This is Aoyama Ichome. Train doors are now closing. Please stand back. Please, take your time. We beat Kamushida and all, but I'm still feeling kinda nervous. I guess we just gotta wait and see what happens. Oh, I'm still looking for a place to train. I guess I'll let you know when I find one. What? Oh, hey. Okay. Takemi, you came because you saw my messages, right? I want to do a clinical trial. Takemi, I wish I could study data outside once in a while, like at a spacious park. Somewhere that's not too crowded would be best. Maybe I'll look for one when I have some time. Alright, let's get to the clinical trial. <laughs> please head to the exam room. Well then, please head into the examination room. Takemi is pleased. She was able to collect useful data. I feel like my bond with Takemi will grow stronger soon. Alright? I hope you can help me out again sometime. The train stop? Was it another one of those psychotic breakdowns? Another minister has resigned? What is going on? How stupid do you have to be to commit adultery? They must be nuts, swinging at that knife around on a train? There are too many crazy people. Where are all the sane people? Ah, you're back. Post, hey there. Oh? Oh, the same news. Hmm?
Okay. Guy McVeer, adventures of a man who is proficient in jury rigging tools out of anything. There's sulfur leaking from the tank. We need to do something fast. It's fine. I'll just use this chocolate. See? The acid <laughs> and the sugar are reacting. It's a story about a man who never gives up, beating all odds with science and ingenuity. Wow! He fixed the tank's crack with chocolate. How does he? How does he stay so calm at a time like that? What really? Hey, hey. Can you really fix a tank's crack with a chocolate? Morgana, the protagonist knew just what to do, despite the crazy situation. Maybe you learn a thing or two about proficiency from watching this drama. Well then. Well, it's starting to get late. Let's head to bed soon, okay? Ah, we were able to get to grab a seat. Why don't you do something until we get there? Ah, Buchiko story. Hmm? After his death, the statue of Buchi became a symbol of Shibuya. Hmm. Buchiko, the story about this dog makes me cry every time. So you finish reading Buchiko's story, a dog who kept waiting for his master in Shibuya, huh? a noble and loyal friend to the end. I have to admit, this story moved me. Can't you feel it warm your heart too? Mm -hmm. Oh, we're almost at the station. I'd say that was an efficient use of your time. The board, board meeting is the day after tomorrow. I wonder if Kamoshida really had a change of heart. What if we failed? Uh, that's all I've been able to think about. Worried, huh? Avenging Shiho and getting your expulsions revoked? It's all resting on this one chance. Of course I'm worried. But the only thing I can do now is believe. And wait. Sorry. Thanks for listening. We should get to school. Hi, everyone. Miss Chono. How are you all doing? These days, you are expected to know colloquial English. Even its idioms that come from other languages. I want you to forget that you are Japanese during this class and make yourself believe you're a foreigner. What's important is becoming a someone else. In this day and age, being able to swap your mask depending on the situation is a critical talent. How will you fare, Mr. Amamiya? Here's a question. Let's hear it. Are you a wonder kind? See if you can work out the answer based on what you know. Um. Are you a wonder kind? Well, it seems to me like we need to work out what that is so we can answer it properly. My German is a little rusty, but I'll give you a hand if I can. Wait. You learn German, Morgana? First off, the wonder part probably means wonder. Morgana, right, wonder, so something, wondrous, I guess, or impressive. Next, the, the kind part, that's probably... 
child. Um, let's think about this again. Uh huh. If the kin in kindergarten refers to all the kids in it, yeah, that's gotta be it. Kin means a child, or at least a young guy in your case. A prodigy. This is it. That's correct. I was asking you if you were a wonder child, in other words, a youth of uncommon talent. But I suppose if you were able to think and adapt so quickly, that proves you certainly must be. Oh, the word talent comes from the Greek talanton, a sum of money referenced in the Bible. The more skilled a servant was, the more coins they would receive from God. Their talent led to wealth. Black-haired student. He is pretty smart. Brown-haired student. I didn't expect that. He might not be too bad. Nice going. You're on a roll today. Miss Chono. The English word talent didn't originally have anything to do with our modern concept of celebrity. But the ability to change one's mask depending on the situation is surely a talent given to one by God. It's not too far off calling people who can react to things on the spot on TV talents. <laughs> the talent of changing masks, does that make us all wonder thieves? I guess so. Let's do it. Movie theater. Already watched a movie. Morgana, there are so many snacks in here. Is someone gonna have a party? Oh, we should have a big party too if we complete our mission. Oh, we can examine that. Alright. Let's go read some books. Hmm? At a time like this? Hilarious. Hmm? Hmm? Morgana, your knowledge might improve if you study at one of the open hey. tables. There's other people around, but your guts might improve because of it. What do you want to do? Study here? I'll pass. But I wanna... Hmm? Hmm? Honestly, I want to read books. Really where, wh where can I read books? Hmm? Maybe I should try studying here, right? Honestly, I don't really care. Hey. Hey. Let's do it. Wait, is that guy really going to sit down and study? Maybe he's more of a serious student than he looks. Whoa, don't stare at him. If your eyes meet, that guy is gonna kill you. Okay. 
Sheesh, can't they take their conversation somewhere else? Good job not getting discouraged by the bad reputation. That dauntless spirit will take you far in life. Man. There's no way anyone could focus on studying in this environment. Let's change Kamoshida's heart and redeem ourselves. Wanna head back? Well, it's getting late. You should probably call it quits for today. Ah, you're back. Oh, I forgot to return the movie to to the uh, rental shop. Damn it. Narrator, led by a mysterious figure, the Feather Men reunite, however their memories have been stolen. Is there any way they can regain their lost memories? Revive and fight Phoenix Rangers. Next episode, don't take three steps, you lose your memories. Yeah, I, I finished watching... wait. Have I finished watching MacGyver? I don't think so. So Jiro, it's only a little, but it helps now that you've learned the ropes. Are you helping out today? Yeah, help him out. <laughs> I'll teach you how to make a good coffee. It tastes all depends on you though. Well. Okay, today we're gonna try brewing a cup of coffee from step one. Just listen to what I tell you. These beans are Colombian, a medium fine city roast. Oh, and don't let the water boil too much. You're gonna be fine, I'll be here the whole time. Yeah. Not bad, though I guess anyone can do something as simple as just brewing it. Making a blend, on the other hand, is a different story. Mixing beans at random won't do you any good. That's because the acidity and the flavor profile all depend on the bean ratio. Pretty deep, huh? Tell me more. Sojiro. Oh, somebody's enthusiastic. If you are really that interested, feel free to try out whatever combinations you want to. Oh, but hands off the expensive beans, got it. Next up is the curry. There is something special about its, its flavor. The truth is, a scientific genius actually came up with the perfect spice combo to complement my coffee. Something about the quantification of taste. There is no formula for flavor, but it is pretty damn good. Anyhow, we don't make compromises when it comes to food service. Our staffs got to wow the customers. This is a tiny shop after all. Self-satisfaction is the only thing that, that keeps me going. You. <sighs> Haven't I already told you I don't have the money? Look at this place. You see many customers in here. Cheerful elderly man. Oh, no need to hide it, Sakura-san. You must have saved plenty from your time working in the government. Aren't you taking care of that employee right there too, for nothing more than charity? I wish you'd show me the same kindness you show others. Wait, does Sakura owe someone money? <sighs> Sojiro, if you are not planning on buying anything, can you please leave? I'm expecting a phone call so I don't have the time to chat with you. Cheerful elderly man. I don't mind if you take the call in front of me. I can talk to your little friend here in the meantime. So, should we keep talking until your call comes in? Or would that be too inconvenient for you? Sojiro. Well... It looks like Sojiro's in trouble. What should I do? Kick the man out. Run for help. Call Sojiro's phone.
Sojiro. Oh, there's the social services call I was waiting for. They come round pretty often to make sure this guy's not getting in any trouble. Want me to introduce you? Cheerful elderly man. Oh, that's right. I have some business I need to take care of myself. I'll come back later. Wait. Is he afraid of social services? Who is this guy? Jeez. Does he really have nothing better to do? Sigh. I guess I should explain what's going on. He might try and drop by when I'm not around. That man is an old acquaintance of mine who's short on cash right now. Looks pretty friendly, yeah? Don't let him fool you. It's all an act. I have to say though, I'm surprised you were quick-witted enough to pull that stuff off. You really saved me back there, thanks. I feel like my bond with Sojiro is growing deeper. Confidence Sojiro Sakura, Arcana Hiero, Rank 4, New Ability, Leblanc Curry. Allows you to make curry that slightly restores SP of all allies. All right. Sojiro, still, why do you poke around into other people's troubles? It's way easier to ignore them. I guess it's just the kind of person you are though, huh? It's that time already. Sigh, I'd report him to the cops if he wasn't related to her. What? Her? Oh, uh, never mind that. Uh, Sojiro's girlfriend or wife maybe. Now then. Anyway, wait, hold on. When Ren talked about date, Sojiro said I wish. So it can't be his wife, I think. Maybe it's his girlfriend. Sojiro. Anyway, that's it for today. Go study or something after you close up. I can see the compassion hidden beneath Sojiro's actions. I feel my kindness growing. Sojiro, hey Ren. Sorry about today, didn't mean to get you wrapped up in my problems. I probably don't have to say it, but if that guy shows up while I'm out, just try to ignore him, okay? Just let him do his thing and get on with the job, got it. I'll kick him out. Sojiro, did you listen to a word I said? You are still under probation, so no matter what he says, don't cause a scene. Alright, I'm trusting you on this. Later. Well then. That reminds me, the home shopping program is airing today. You wanna check out the TV? Yeah, sure. Mm. The board meetings tomorrow. Nice. Pompous customer, did you know that there are betting cages in the vicinity? I failed to see the appeal though, adults swinging bats, screaming their grievances at society. I want to go. Huh, you don't need to relieve your stress like that, not until the hardships of adulthood. And you are too old to try becoming a baseball player. Even so, it could be a pleasant distraction. Visit the batting cages if you are ever free, though it is ill-suited to an intellectual like me. Gah, I got my back. Well, I'll be going home then. What? Male host. Hi everyone, it's time to do some shopping. Here's what we've got for you today. Let's start with this. The military... The military ration set. You can't fight on an empty stomach, so get your nutrients with this. Tori Meshi ration, MRE ration, and beef patty ration all in one. What a deal. But wait, there is more. Next up is the muscle workout set. 
you'll see an enormous improvement in your training results. This set includes 2 protein and 2 moist protein. I can't believe they're both in one set, what a steal. Wow, a female host, wow they're both such great items, I can't decide which one to get. Male host, alright, this is a limited item, today's the one and only day it'll be available. And of course, the price is just right, you won't see this kind of deal ever again. Female host, oh the phones are already ringing off the hook. Male host, only a few remaining, now's your final chance to buy, bye bye. Hey, hey. Morgana. Apparently the phones are ringing non-stop. If we buy one, then the other will probably be sold out before we can get it. Ah, uh, get the more expensive one. Muscle workout set. Friends may come and go, but muscles are forever. Great support for training. Female host. Oh, another bar just called in. Thank you so much. Oh, they're both sold out. That last customer was extraordinarily lucky. Male host. We'll try to get your order to you as quickly as possible. Goodbye for now. We'll see you again next time with another fabulous product. Female host. Goodbye for now. Well then. Now all we have to do is wait for it to arrive. Oh. Don't you already have an order coming? I can't wait for it to get here. Let's do it. All sorts of people gather in the big city. Crooks are everywhere. How can I help you? You don't know anything. What's the meaning of this? Why must I suffer? Oh! You don't know anything. What's the meaning of this? Hmm? You can now quick travel to the flower shop in Shibuya. You applied to work part-time at this flower shop, didn't you? What do you want to do? The flowers smell nice. What are you going to do? I'll work here. I'll do some shopping. Florist. Having flowers nearby can really brighten your mood. I recommend feeding them plant nutrients. What would you like? Plant balm. Natural oil harvested from plants can be used as fuel for machine tools. Cork bark. Elastic bark can be used as a component when making tools. 
Thank you for your purchase. What do you want to do? I'll work here. Morgana, you may be able to work on your kindness if you work at a flower store. Want to use this time to work? I'll work. Nice to meet you. Female shop worker, nice to meet you. I'm Megumi Hanasaki, the owner of, of this shop. I'll do everything myself today, so you can just observe me and try to learn the ropes. Good luck. Well, let's begin. Her name is Hanasaki. Hey. Hana, Hana means flower, right? Morgana, perfect. That apron suits you. Here. Well, here's your pay for today. You did great. Good work, Rankun. Come back again when you have the time. How are you feeling? Nice job. You work pretty hard today. Still, I bet this job making gifts has boosted your kindness. Mm. Wanna head back? Alright, we should head home. Hey! Tomorrow's the board meeting. Don't worry, I'm sure the change of heart worked. A message from Anne. The board meeting is tomorrow, right? Ryuji. We're gonna get expelled if Kamushira doesn't have a change of heart by then. Ren, we did all we could. Anne, either way, I'm not going to lose hope. Ryuji, you're right. It's a little too early to be giving up now. Guess we're gonna find out one way or the other tomorrow. We just gotta brace ourselves for all the possibilities. I'm sorry I can't offer more reassurance. But he should have the change of heart. Let's just believe in that while we wait for tomorrow. Hey, hey! Whatever happens, it's not your fault. Morgana. Morgana. Oh, right. You've been carrying around that sooty armor. How about you wash that over at the laundromat? Do I want to? Hey. Yeah, why not? Let's try it, laundromat. Freshly bathed old person. Phew, today's bath was simply amazing as usual. Every Sunday feels like heaven when the medicinal bath permeates into my bones. Now then, should I head home or drop by the bar first? Ah, uh, maybe I should try the bath. I don't know. Welcome. You'll have those days. Why must I suffer? You'll know anything. What's the meaning of this? Bathhouse. Wow. This is the bathhouse. Hum, it's in such a secluded area. Maybe relaxing at the bathhouse can help boost your charm. Oh. Sniff, sniff. It's a medicinal bath today. What do you want to do? Want to go refresh yourself with the bath? It's 500 Eng to enter. Let's go in. The Mugwort bath is warming me up. Oh, Mugwort is the name of, of a leaf, right? Yeah, I think so. Morgana, you came out of there looking really refreshed. This medicinal bath must be quite effective. Oh, and you smell good too. You are looking great.
Want to head back? Come on, we should get home before you get cold. Alright. <sighs> this is no good. Sleepy looking guy, yawn. Mondays are such a drag. Why couldn't they give us two day off too? We have the rest of the week off starting tomorrow. Serious looking guy. Yeah, it's ridiculous. Speaking of, what's up with that calling card? The one sent to Kamoshida. Wait, is that Mishima Kung on the left? Serious looking guy. Didn't it say something about stealing his distorted desires? Or something weird like that? Sleepy looking guy. Yeah, something like that. I'm sure it's just a prank. No one's taking it seriously. What's with the sudden morning assembly? Brown haired student. I bet it's about that girl that jumped the other day. Flashy student. Oh, this is the girl who was being mean to one of the to one of the teachers, I think. They don't have to tell us not to commit suicide. Well, maybe he should not. Maybe she wasn't being mean. Maybe they were close. Maybe they are friends. I mean, there was that weird calling card too. So I guess the teachers are freaking out. We're lucky that morning practice got canceled, though. I feel like I'm gonna faint if this takes forever. <sighs> Let's begin this school-wide morning assembly. As you all know, a tragic event took place the other day. Thankfully, we have been informed that she has pulled through, but it will take time until she recovers. So, she who survives. Good. Everyone here has a bright future ahead. I implore that you rethink the importance of life and... <sighs> Mr. Kamashida, what's the... I... have been reborn. That is why I will confess everything to you all. Huh? What's wrong with Mr. Kamashida? What's this about? Confess? Did the volleyball team do something? I have repeatedly done things that were... unbecoming of a teacher. Verbally abusing students, physically abusing my team, and sexually harassing female students. I am the reason why Shiho Suzui tried to kill herself. Sexual harassment? What? Why would he say oh, that uh, himself? He is the so worst. Really? Physical abuse? I thought of this school as my own castle. There were even students that I sentenced to expulsion simply because I didn't like them. I will, of course, rescind those. I am truly sorry for putting innocent youths through such horrible acts. I am an arrogant, shallow, and shameful person. No, I'm worse than that. I will take responsibility. I kill myself for it. What? Did he just say that? Wait, kill himself? Mr. Kamoshida is, uh, not well. Mr. Kamoshida, please get off the stage for now. Everyone, return to your classes. I... Don't run, you bastard! Shiho's still alive. Even after all the things that made her want to die! You have no right to run from this! You're right. You're absolutely right. 
I should be punished under the law and atone for my crimes. I did horrible things to Takamaki-san as well. In return for giving Suzui-san a position on the team, I... I tried to force her into having relations. Disgusting. Ugh. For a position on the team? Feels so That's bad horrible. For so the rumors son. weren't true. As of today, I will resign from my position as an instructor and turn myself in. <laughs> Someone please call the police! The police? Is he for real? He's gonna get wow. arrested? This morning's assembly is over. Return to your classes immediately! Isn't this just like what that calling card said? Does this mean the Phantom Thieves thing was for real? Was something done to Kamoshida? Come on, there's no way you could steal someone's heart. But why else would he start saying things like he'll kill himself or turn himself in? Maybe because it almost got leaked? Don't they go easier on you if you turn yourself in? I wonder what happened. Fleshy student. Haha. <laughs> Who knows? But man, Kamashita turned out to be one sick bastard. Ren aspires to be a sick bastard like Kamushida. But Ren will be smarter than Kamushida. <laughs> hey, is this for real? He's turning himself in just like that? What's going to happen this to the boys? Will show up this now? Is gonna be a Return to your classrooms at once! His heart really did change. Seems like it. But was this really for the best? But what Kamushida said. You mean the police stuff? Well, that's true. Huh? What the? Takamaki-san, I'm sorry. Huh? We all knew, but we pretended we didn't. I should have answered by saying I don't know. I mean, do I want Kamushida to confess and get arrested? Or do I want him to change and make amends? I don't know. I should have answered I don't know instead of the third option. Takamaki-san, I had you all wrong. I'm sorry that I spread rumors about you. I didn't know at all. Oh, Kamashita was forcefully pushing himself on you. It must have been so hard for you. I'm sure there's a ton of people who want to apologize to you. We're so sorry. No, it's okay. The same goes for me, too. Besides, that's all in the past now. Hey! You there! Return to class at once! Well, see you later then. I can't apologize enough for what I did to you. I swear I'll make it up to you someday. Yeah, I don't know if it's for the best. Which is the best outcome? Kamushida turning himself to the police? Or Kamushida making amends for his actions? Even though, even though he he can never uh, completely make amends because you know um, the victims they they you know they they are really affected by it, especially uh, Shiho. But even so, even if the even if the amendment cannot be one hundred percent. I don't know. Hmm. 
Looks like Kamoshida ain't the only one that had a change of heart. Man, I'm glad for you. Looks like those weird rumors are gonna go away. My thing doesn't really matter. We made Kamoshida apologize about Shiho. That's more than enough for me. No, not not enough. Uh, he has to make amends. And... Um, it's up to Shiho though. Does, does Shiho and the other victims want Kamoshida to be in prison? I mean, they are the victims. Not, not, not Ren. Um, yeah, it's also up to Takamaki as well and uh, Ryuji because Kamoshida broke his leg too. Mm. If they want Kamoshida to go to prison, then prison it is. But in the context of what Anne is saying, apologizing isn't enough. He has to make amends. You know, hypothetically, if he didn't go to prison, sorry isn't enough. He has to make amends. You should hurry and tell her about it then. Yeah. I totally freaked out. He really did have a change of heart. Especially, especially if rape is involved. It's not, you know, it's not, it's not, it's not going to be easy for the victim to, to accept that the rapist is making amends instead of suffering the consequences. Assuming, assuming Shiho was raped by Kamushida, then yeah, maybe sh uh, I think there is a possibility Shiho don't want Kamushida to make amends, but instead she wants Kamushi Kamushida to suffer the consequences, which is which is going to prison. And we were lucky his mind didn't get messed up either. <laughs> this was an A-plus job. Does this mean that they won't have a mental shutdown even if their palace disappears? I see. So we need to persuade the shadow without killing it, and then send it back to its real self. Our targets won't undergo a cognitive collapse if we do that. So we can get him to confess with no bad stuff? Hey, that works for me. Do you have to be so loud? Eh, don't worry about it. So, how'd it go? With Shiho, I mean. She's regained consciousness. Nice. Now Ren can make a move on her. Or maybe not. I mean, she's traumatized, Ren. Would, would Ren really want to... To, to to share the burden especially that especially that Ren knows what happened to to Shiho if Ren doesn't know then it might be a different story for real it was only for a little bit but I got to talk to her Anne, please go to the restroom if you are going to poop this is not the restroom. I was able to tell her that Kamoshida admitted to what he did. Shiho, she... She told me she was sorry. Sorry for what? She's the victim. I mean, one of the victims. But she is a victim. Sorry for what? Looks like she found out that I was flirting with Kamoshida for her sake. What? Yeah, Takamaki is also a victim, but there is no reason for Shio to say sorry. I don't understand. And here I was, wanting to apologize to her. Kamoshida's at fault for all this. Yeah, not the yeah the blames on him, not on uh, not on Shio, not on Anne. 
I know. Shiho's mom is thinking of transferring her to another school after she recovers. Of course. Uh, Shiho is traumatized. Definitely. The whole sexual harassment and attempted suicide. People will label her after that. I wonder if it's just sexual harassment. I mean, was it... I mean, was it as far as rape? I don't know, but, but the story keeps saying sexual harassment instead of rape. Maybe... Maybe rape wasn't involved. Not yet. It sounded like Shiho had the same idea too. Ah, it's gonna get lonely. What I mean by not yet is, there is a possibility that maybe Kamushida wanted to, but didn't have the chance to do it. What is gonna get lonely? Oh, Ryuji, uh, do you fancy uh, Shiho? But I think it's for the best. I'm sure it'll be hard if she stays here. Oh, I think Ryuji was saying lonely for Anne, not for himself. She's alive. You can see her anytime. I need to change too. That aside, I was surprised you could hold yourself back against Kamoshida's shadow. It wasn't like that. I just wanted Kamoshida to apologize himself. You're so kind, Lady An. Okay, if apology is enough for Anne, maybe rape wasn't involved. No matter how much of a shitbag he was, finishing him off would have left a bad aftertaste, huh? Huh? That's not it. I think revenge is better served if I make him repent. Realizing what he's done, he'll grovel for forgiveness the rest of his life, you know? I just believe... There are fates worse than death. Holy shit. Uh, anyways, that's all settled. But, you know, there was one more thing I was wondering about that castle. Why was Kamoshida the only one who had that metaverse thing? It isn't necessarily limited to him. It's something anyone could have if their heart became warped from their desires. Anyone. Wanna check it out? Not right now. We better lay low for a while. People are still gonna be talking about Kamoshida. Then again, it's totally impossible for someone to find out what we did at his palace. Yeah, about that, weird rumors about you guys are already going around. Wait, are they gossiping about Ren's and Ryuji's relationship? Maybe they think Ryuji and Ren are lovers now. Stuff like, you got together and threatened Kamoshida with something close to physical violence. Oh, okay. The hell? People aren't going to easily believe that phantom thieves really exist. Oh, they thought that Ryuji and Ren was physically intimidating Kamoshida into confessing his, his crimes. Ah, I see calling cards being treated like it was a prank by someone who knew what Kamoshida was doing. Hmm, makes sense. Well, it's best that way, right? I think it's best for people to not know um, their special abilities. We're the ones who did it, and I still don't completely believe it myself. <laughs> let's wait for things to settle down for the time being. Anyways, let's check how much this metal can be sold for. It'd be better if we pawned it off ASAP. Ooh, got a hit! Wait, 30,000 yen? That's all a gold medal's worth? Remember that time in middle school? I lent you some money. There's no way I borrowed 30,000 yen from you. Wouldn't it be around that much with compounded interest? Interest my ass? Usury. Damn you, Anne. I'm not saying that I'm taking all of it. I mean, it's your fault for not paying me back all these years. 
It's just common sense. How about Ryuji pay you back with a kiss and a day? Ah, damn it. <laughs> I agree on laying low and keeping an eye on the situation. However, you dragged me into this. It would be nonsense not to celebrate a successful mission. I guess we could blow this dirty money on something fun. Discussions among phantom thieves are to take place over luxurious food. How about it? Hey, wait! Nah, uh, I guess it's fine. There's somewhere I want to go then. Where's that? It's a place Shiho and I have been wanting to go for a while. Ah. Uh, then we should bring Shiho with us, right? I owe money, so I can't complain. Are we going to bring Shiho? You good with that? Fine by me. I'll leave it to your discretion as well, Lady On. I'll call and check the prices later then. When should we go? Want to do it soon? Like, tomorrow? Yeah, let's do it soon. And let's bring Sh Oh, but if we do it tomorrow, then we can't bring Shiho. Because she's still recovering, right? Maybe we can go twice. Once uh, without Shiho. And again with Shiho. I hope so. Why don't we go on the last day of the holidays? Last day of the holidays. Will Shiho be... Will, will Shiho already recovered by then? It'll help energize us when school life starts up again the day after. Then, uh, the 5th, on Children's Day. So, who's going to sell this? Leave that to us. We know a store that'll buy anything, don't we? A store that'll buy anything? No, I don't know. Okay, I'll leave that to you guys. What store are you talking about? Morgana What store? Which store are you talking about Morgana? Ah, you're back A message from Anne. Is that gold medal real? When did it get inside his palace? No, that one is a fake It's just a byproduct of his cognition Ah So Something that exists in the metaverse can materialize in the real world. The real metal should still be in his possession. Ren, Kamushida has the real one. Ryuji, what? You're telling me Kamushida still got the medal? An, who cares? What matters is that we change his heart. And anyway, if we had taken the real thing, that would be stealing. I don't think he'll be proud of that medal anymore regardless. Ryuji, you let go of stuff pretty easy, huh? Wanna forget about my dad? An, that's different. 500 yen is a lot of money for a middle schooler, you know. Wait, from 500 yen to 30,000? Dang. Anne is a banker. Anne, do you even still have that dolphin anyway? Ren, dolphin? Ryuji, stop digging that up. Anne, back in middle school, we went on a field trip to the aquarium. But Ryuji had to spend all his money on a souvenir, so I lent him some for the train fare. Ryuji, I said I was sorry. That was for my mom. Anne, well I guess I can call it even after all we've been through. Ryuji, thank you. Anyways, we don't got to worry about selling that medal off if it's a fake. End of story. Kamashita will never be proud of that once in a lifetime gold medal ever again. Depending on how you look at it, that punishment might be even worse than death for him. <sighs> Starting tomorrow, you'll have a lot of time off, huh? Must be nice. For me, it just means more customers and even more work. Yo. Another box came for you. Hey! What did you get? Protein? Moist protein? Oh! 
Must be what you ordered from the TV. I'll just add this. Alright. Uh, 